Greetings and greetings and greetings. Welcome to the breakdown with DJ Odyssey and I am DJ Odyssey of course. And today I want us to talk about the templates on FL Studio, like how to use a template, like use it to for for as your default template. Every time you open every time you open FL Studio, you have a template opening up with your stuff so that you can be able to work properly that the stuff that you know, you know, and then that way you can be faster than every time you have to like every time you have a kick you have to like open a new channel on your mixer and all that so this is a mixer template that's gonna work for you that's gonna work for all of us so you done it it's like this let's just say it you just like me i just made this and then it looks like this so i want this to become my default template every time i open studio fl studio basically so now the song you say save as file save as and then with FL studio 20 right this is what happens uh you go into documents and then you'll find the image line and then you'll find f data and then you'll find FL studio and inside FL studio you'll find uh projects and then you'll find templates and then you name it as uh or DJ Odyssey template let me say new right so and I say save so now I have a template inside FL studio so it means if I close FL studio now uh, I can now say open FL studio again and as we wait and as we wait in as we wait and then when you open FL Studio it opens like this what this like my, my other template is the same thing but either way then you can have open from new from template and then you go and say DJ Odyssey beat template new you say that and it opens this template and once it opens this template what you do next is you want it you want this to be a default so you say project and you can say fine i don't remember which part yeah default template down there on general down at the bottom startup project default template you say the template new and then you close and then you can close the first studio and then next time you open the first studio it will just it will just open up with your template so whenever maybe you have a beat like the drums maybe that you use quite often um if you have yeah like you have your drums that you use often like maybe you'll synth everything you can also put them onto your template like as a startup thing every time you open a first studio you already have your kick your drum your favorite ones you already put them onto your template and then it saves you a lot of time like for some of us to actually go on the site and then try to find you know, i need a kick you know you need a kick yeah but but this time you have a kick you have everything that you needed and then it's there so at least for some of us i just have a pack where i have my favorite cakes my favorite snacks everything it's on my folder um so that way i don't have to go and look for other packs from other people so i have my own packs but it means sometimes i still go back and try to find new sounds or create new sounds and put them into my pack and then that's good it's great for all of us and then thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel for more tips more tutorials more beats and everything and i'll see you on the next video thank you very much yo